Good afternoon, everybody. And hey, we're back to episode 10 of North Carolina in Minecraft Season 2, but also in the Wild Update. We got the Tower of Tough and Onslow Tower just right in the distance, but hold on. You really thought I'd start this episode, cat? No. You must have forgotten. We always do something at the very beginning of these episodes. And that is to ring the bell of glory. Jacksonville, North Carolina. The 17 story tall Onslow Tower is perfect. Why isn't this thing even in Jacksonville in real life? I don't know. I think it should be there. But no, some people just don't care about what I think. But if you lived in Jacksonville, North Carolina, you're not gonna lie. You wish it had super tall structures there. And how can you identify this as Onslow Tower? By looking at the word at the very bottom, near the first floor. Onslow. O-N-S-L-O-W. Onslow. And today, my fellow Minecrafters, along with ladies and gentle bugs, I kind of want to try to find a nether fortress, or at least start up a portal network within the nether. Bad idea, I know, because I could potentially die in lava, but... You must have forgotten who I am, haven't you? So of course we start that by getting obsidian real fast, thanks to our perfectly enchanted diamond pickaxe. And also, we got no optifine this episode. Yeah, it's gonna be somewhat laggy a few times, but hey, I won't mind. I was born in the lag, I was molded by it, there's no way it will stop me. All this obsidian gathering is just far too easy for now. Can they even make it a challenge? No, I guess not. Well, there is lava, so it is somewhat risky. But hey. I am no coward, I always step over lava. Wow, Bonzo Tower really does look nice in the night. But too bad I can't see the top tower from all the way over here. And it would've shined nicely as well. But, nah, my render distance is set to six, so I guess that's kind of my fault. Oh, are you serious? Just like that, I wouldn't have to worry about any monsters in this update so far. And these guys have to come in and ruin my life again. Then, why don't, why don't you just taste the wrath of my good old Bash and Burn? Yes, that's the name of my sword. Good old Bash and Burn. I like it, it sounds nice, because it represents my fiery and relentless lust for blood in Minecraft. I mean, we don't have blood in this game, it's fantasy violence. Come on, Creeper. We're gonna look for your skeleton friends. Oh, in fact, we already found them. Just need to get that good shot. Okay, cool of them. Maybe this will be easier. I know what you were thinking. Wait, what the heck was that? Cakebug, I'm gonna be honest with you. After that wheeze, you sounded like a pterodactyl. I think I got a new disc. Ward, I never had that one. Yeah, that's perfect. Finally, we get one that I never had in this playthrough so far. Yeah, that makes me kind of happy. Come on, Creeper, you're gonna give me another one. You're gonna give me another one. You're gonna give me another disc. Oh, no, 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 not like that, no. Come on, Skelly. Ow, almost had it. I am literally being cornered right now by everything except for wardens. Yay, no wardens are attacking me. Aren't I just glad about that? I smell pennies! <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be very boned. Reapers, good, they're still following me. And now the skeleton is attacking once more. Lagging, it's fine. Get that spider out of my way. Creeper! Wrong one. Ha! Ah, epic dodge. Get fooled! Wait, is that another new disc that I didn't get yet? Wait, where, where did the arrow even go? Doesn't matter, I still got the disc! That's all that matters. No, not you three again! 
The trio that knows how to make me suffer. I sir hate you. Uh, I'll be sure that you are dead. Not a big surprise. Come on, get a little bit closer. Die. And there you go. Now you're out of my way. No, disc. Stall? I don't think I ever got that one. Where's the other phantom? I just heard it. Where is it? Is the phantom stuck in the tree? Because I can't see it. He's just a survivor. Why are you going that far away? Why is it? Why is it eating me? It's weird. But... Tridents will help. Phantoms, why won't you leave me alone? Is it because I disturb your privacy in the air? Because of Onslow Tower? It was my idea! MINE! Let's check the disc collection for any discs. Uh, yeah, I already had stall, apparently. Okay. I got two fars, and do I have three malls? I have three malls, apparently. That's good. Now, into the nether we go. Yeah, I built me some bit of a fortification in the nether just in case if any monsters try to come out and attack me in the middle of nowhere. You know what? I'm gonna grab some cobblestone blocks real quick. This biome has always given me the creeps because of... Oh no. I can't let him kill me right now. I have to get rid of him. I don't care if the child is right there. I have to kill him. I can't let him do the same thing he did to me in episode 5. Hey! Hey! Relax! You are not my target. The big fat hog was! And I just watch out for her! The child spotted me! But he doesn't know how to get in. Such a pity. Really wish his parents would have taught him to never attack a stranger! How you feel? There are on top of my fortification. They fall undead. Wait, good old Bash and Burn can set them on fire! Hello there, Hoglins! Good to see you again. Go on, try to attack me! I dare you! Come on, try it, big guy. You can attack if you want, but I am not gonna turn tail. So go on, come closer. If you wanna die! What a shame. None of you decided to put up a fight. I expected more from the two ugly werehogs that killed me in episode 5 of my first Minecraft season. But I guess they were just a bunch of wimpy little cowards waiting for their lives to come to an end. And children, don't worry. They were asking for it. They deserved it. It's not right what they did to me in the last few episodes. Trust me. Now let's dig this thing. It's time to let the pigs fight each other. Only the future can determine my fate. No, only I can determine my fate. I'm in full control of that. No one else is! Looks like the portal network thing didn't work out so far as I expected it to. So you know what? This is what's gonna happen. North Carolina! Right now, let's just go trade with some villagers. Because I got nothing else better to do right now. Hello there. Shall we trade? Oh, 20 wheat for an emerald? Sure, I'll take that. Carrots as well. Hm. What a deal indeed. And also an emerald for six bread. I just got this emerald. Okay, I got more wheat now. Now once again, trade with me. Huh? You heard me, trade. There we go. Oh, ran out of wheat. Oh, that's no biggie. You got plenty of hay bales here. Hmm. Wonder what's in here? Just a blast furnace, like I saw a couple episodes ago. You again, you have no choice anymore. You're going to trade with me! Wait for emeralds! There we go, past novice. And level 31 for me. Yeah! Finally, you can heal yourself. Six pumpkins for an emerald? Please, that'll be worth it. Y'all, this tree is one of the most cursed things I've ever seen ever in Minecraft. This cannot stand. It has to be cut down. You know what? Let's go explore by sea. I have been exploring the rest of this world away from the west of my base, so now let's just go on ahead and see what is lying ahead of us. 
and my curiosity rewards me. Found two new biomes and just one. Pulls? Yeah! But I just remembered, each and every time whenever I publish these videos, it's always around dinner time. And you know what? I'm starving! And you know what? I actually apologize if the episode was rather short because I couldn't think of anything fun to do right now. Besides hunting discs and trading with villagers and probably expanding my portal network in the nether. But overall, you know what has to be done before we end the episode. This is all that's left for today. Stop it, mouse. Thank you. Stay still. Thanks, Pally. Jacksonville!